Now, what I'm really curious about is the test, all right? Because a lot of people, I think what we're going to do with the test, just like you described, is we've got to make sure we've got the hypothesis right. We want to test an hypothesis. You want to make it as simple as possible, as low cost as possible, so that the taking it from idea to ignition is as easy as possible. Exactly. So what is your level of success? What point you're going this is resonating is there a number so for example when you test you, you take a facebook ad and you drive it to the page and you're going okay so you're looking just for click throughs aren't you really is that correct that's it yeah so it depends on the experiment setup yep. um, but you want to think about it before you run the experiment what would give me confidence that this is something mm -hmm. that people actually want so if you predefine it and you set a success metric. Um, so let's say I want 100 signups before I feel like this is worth my time. Or I want a click-through rate of at least 1% before um, I invest more. Um, then those are can be your success metrics. I would look at benchmarks. Um, uh, like when you just Google like benchmark, click-through rate, you can find potential comparisons that can give you an, an uh, early bar of what to look for. Um, I recognize this is like not an easy early thing because you don't know what you don't know. Like it's not like you've had previous company history to reference, um, but use others to try to figure it out. Um, you might want to, you know, message people and ask, like, let's say, you know, someone who works at a company or has started a company, like what was your initial click through rate? Like what, what did you look at? Those can give you insights. But otherwise, if you have no, no additional inputs, I would ask just focus on what would make you feel like you want to invest uh, whatever you're going to invest. So let's say you're spending $20,000 on building a mobile app. What amount of confidence would give you like the full uh, fuel to be able to move forward um, and spend that $20,000?